Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Just checking that went through properly. I always do wonder if, uh, <laughs> of course, that music goes through <laughs> on the course. stream. Uh, hello, everybody. Welcome, of course, back uh, to another Slytherin stream uh, brought to you by myself, the Mr. Mr. Richards, Richards of York. Uh, and, of course, we are here yet again with another rendition of uh, What is Your Mod? And, of course, this brings us back, of course, to Field of Glory uh, Medieval, where uh, I've got to say um, we've had a right cool um, mod recently uh, in the last couple of months. We've had, of course, the Silk Road. Uh, we've had Game of Thrones. Uh, and now we are here. People say, people say we want a pike and shot too. People moan about it all the time. Pike and shot too. But we got something slightly better to, to kind of quench your appetite. We have an 18th century mod for Field of Glory Medieval. I will, of course, put all the links into the chat. But, of course, if you're not watching this uh, live on Twitch or you're watching this on YouTube, uh, just go to the Slytherin forum. Uh, type, uh, I think you can go on to the medieval modding and the Field of Glory modding, uh, and of course it will be on there. If you are here live, I'll drop it into the chat, uh, and we'll get on with the soon. So we're here for the next hour and a half. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, of course, if you are watching this and you are, you know, you never keep up with the social medias, don't forget to, of course, follow uh, Slytherin on all their social medias. It's a huge year, like every year, with releases and the only way to stay, uh, of course, up to date with all of them is to, of course, uh, follow them on, you know, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, uh, and of course here on Twitch and Insta, if they're doing Insta. Uh, we are here, of course, with uh, the 18th century mod, the Frederick's Great Battles. Uh, I'll let you guys read this. So a couple of uh, really nice things for this mod. Uh, the main functionality, of course, is uh, bringing uh, muskets, bayonets, um, and of course... I don't know if it, I don't think MySpace is a thing anymore, is it? <laughs> uh, is the course the functionality of a uh, Field of Glory? Uh, sorry, a uh, Pike and Shot camp campaigns. Pike and Shot uh, is of course muskets, bayonets, shooting pistols, impact mounted. Of course, the reaction fire. I did try this mod a little bit last night, and I was very impressed. But you can of course find the on the link page. I think I can't remember who the mod is. Uh, I think it's Kronos 09. There is a uh, there's a normal version and there's the uh, updated version. So there is like two versions of this, uh, and of course it brings all the functionality of uh, Pike and Shot uh, to uh, Field of Glory Medieval. There is a couple of epic battles. We're just gonna go and play a few random maps tonight. We've got about an hour and a half, so we're we're gonna drop into this and let's get on with it. Let's hopefully I can click the buttons and my game will just show. Of course not. Just the Twitch. Uh, game capture. Oh, display capture. That's what I've done wrong. There we go. Now you just saw me in Edmund's chat. It doesn't really matter. So here we are. We're, we're going to, of course, we're playing the Prussians for the Austro-Saxon. And we're going to have a look through the units and see all the things we need to do. Um, yeah, I've got to say, I really enjoyed the models for this uh, mod, uh, as you can see fantastic infantry and we're going to go through all of the units uh have a couple of battles see if we can be um what's the word <laughs> uh, not get rammed joe you know i've got to say th the reactive fire gets me every single time and i forget i've not played pike and shot campaigns or pike and shot for a very long time and i probably have to get back into playing something in civil war at some point uh so we'll have a look but remember to click the link and support the the developer of the mod uh it is amazing so so we've got some dragoons we've got high superior protected impact mounted pistols and of course pistols melee which is a finger pike and shot uh we've got cruisers uh impact mounted pistols uh more cavalry impact mounted pistols just different layers of superior protected protected no armor dragoons unprotected pistol mounted impact i've got to check the poas i can't remember how they affect the melee I will, but we'll see that as the combat goes hussars which should be just uh, carbine swords which they are uh, we've got medium guns. The range gets you here, folks. The range. You've actually got range here. Uh, medium guns, artillery. And then we've got light guns, which I think is a lot smaller. I've got, cat I've got to see the range. I've ranged everybody. The range of mediums is large. Musketeers. We've got bayonet. Light plus light guns. One thing I liked about uh, uh, Pike and Shot uh, was, of course, units that had mix. Uh, Coverage and modify without uh, combat abilities losing combat. That's fine. God superior. 
Grenadiers, and we get bombs as well. Muskets and the cohesion penalties, and musketeers, the general troops, which are bayonet, musket like guns, and the grenadiers, which should have bombs again. Okay. The computer does go heavy cav, which I do see. Uh, these are just dragoons. We're sticking to the left. And the cassar. Uh, dragoons, dragoons. So like I said, if you just joined the stream, folks, we are, of course, playing uh, a mod for Field of Glory Medieval. Uh, it's called the 18th Century Mod, which can be found on the Slytherin Forum. I don't know if it, uh, some of the mods can be found, or no, some of the scenarios can be found on the uh, community thing. Uh, we're going to go for some a medium gun because we've got a nice hill at the back. And we've got a light gun. And the computer is semi-competent as well, which is always nice. But things go really fast. The one thing I find about this, the the, 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 the reaction fire is very, very fast here. Uh, God, we've got so many points. Guard Grenadiers. And we'll just go max, max Cav. Max Cav. What's the worst that can happen? 11 points. So we've got one General. Stick in the centre. Uh, he's fine, he's fine, and he is fine. And, oh yeah, I'm just going to count the, the, the squares. Just just, just enviness of the, the range of the artillery. Uh, we're, we're not firing bombards anymore. What's that? Oh, it's got... Is it? Does that mean it's got what? It can't shoot within two. I've never noticed that. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty. That's 15. Does it actually tell me on here? I can't remember if it actually tells me the range of the artillery. No, it won't. It's it's, it's fucking huge. Huge. All right, let's get on with it. So there we go. Like the uh, functionality of uh, Pike and Shot, the reactive fire of the artillery. So, And also, it has like 13 ammunition. Animish, uh, animish. I can't really speak tonight. Has it actually got how much ammo I've got? No, it doesn't. Okay. Uh, we are just going to march forward. And I should not have done that. There we go. It, it can't go as bad as the Silk Road as that the other week. That was a pretty bad for us. Okay, what did the Austro-Hungary bring? Uh, Saxons brought German Guard, Hungarians... But I'm not entirely sure if we can load canister shot for these. I think it's 13 rounds for the artillery. Let's try and shred this cavalry as it runs out as well. I want to move the light cannon up if possible. Does. What's the range for the dragoons? It is literally one. It is literally one. And the range for musketeers one, two, three. So that's four. So four. Alright, let's get them killing fields going. They have a strength value of 530. The cannon, that light cannon, is very mobile. Oh, I don't really want to advance very much further here. And we'll see the defensive fire uh, as the reaction fire happens. Oh, God, he's got a lot of cav there. I love it. The smoke is amazing on this. What the heat? Doesn't show on the combat logs. 
I suppose they're not taking cohesion checks. So he did. So what was the benefits? Uh, shooting at artillery bombs, handguns, minus one additional factor. Yeah. And they have six turns of ammunition before we have to go old glory bayonet time. the wall okay let's uh <laughs> so i think he auto canister shots when the enemy gets when when the enemy gets close the auto canister shot what does the modifier oh that was a bit harsh so commission check shooting enemy can shot by a light gun steady state so it's shooting casualties and so it's just a minus two modifier for the uh for the cannon get some milk You have to like go in his face to shoot him. Oh. Can we turn. It's the reaction fire. Well, if you're a field of glory player and you're not a pike and shot, it really takes you back that the enemy can react to what you do. Uh I'm glad this front line hasn't got any uh, cohesion uh, drops yet. And actually, the there is a reload animation there as well. Oh, they, they are grenadiers. Um, yeah, I think we can do that. I will try canister a shot again, I think. Oh, a bit of fisticuffs. I want to see the POAs here as well. have the animation as well uh okay i think we can cause this guy some issues oh god uh no 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 no, no. what do i want to do oh, some pain i just need to get his control zone gone Okay, so what's the actual POAs here? So we've got just uphill, troop quality. Pfft, that's it. Uh, let's stamp forward. Where's my cannons going to shoot, actually? Uh... So auto canister shots when the enemy get too close. I want to see if the grenadiers actually chuck bombs at people. Nope, I don't know if that's representation or not. Uh, 
Ugh. Oh, them numbers were not great. I played that game. It didn't work. Let's just shoot until people stop moving. I really like it. It's got a good feel to it. Like maybe upping the point list, put point a bit, the point cost, the point for the game would be quite cool. So that's fine. Reserve cab on the left. Is he close enough to canister shot? I wonder what the range is. It's got to be at least two spaces away. I wish the smoke would linger just a little bit. That's one thing would be nice if it would linger a little bit. Were these grenadiers? I think the grenadiers had a sound like broken glass when they get close I don't like or broken bombs or something oh canister shot so he is shooting so he's got two free spaces for canister shot Woo! Let's do that again. So the sound, the sound file of the Grenadiers is I could. I didn't hear it there. I don't know if it was intentional or not. Oh God, lucky me. Yeah, the Grenadiers, the, it's, it's like a sound file where they're just, like, breaking something. Uh, I want to break... Oh, I'll shoot the guys who are disrupting the back. Uh, no, just keep that control zone so nothing charges in the rear. Wiping the floor with them. Not saying we aren't far off breaking here. Oh, here we go. That's the POA there. So, enemy are pistol, melee 100 armor. Oh, God. Massively out POA there. the shot again there. Uh, he is far away. We might, this might end very soon if we get lucky. Uh, I think kind of the shot there. Nope.
Where'd that other cavalry actually run off? Oh, it's here. Be over. Oh, that. And Paul Musketeers on the right having a bad day. So, what would the POA actually just, just check it against these Hazars on just basic infantry? So, the attached guns do help against them, give them plus 50 POA. We're just minus 50. So, we don't really have a POA. Not for the. Not even the swordsman gives us anything there. See if this ends turn nine. You've got plenty of time tonight to play a few more scenarios. I need to check if there's epic battles. There is some bigger battles in this. Got a rally. He may break that unit on the hill, bring us back, bring him back in the game. There we go. Yeah, I think the smoke just needs to last a little bit longer. A few more seconds, kind of a bit more atmospheric. Oh la la! Oh la la, that's gotta hurt. Oh, with that general's POA, they are nas nasty. Get a bit cocky there, thinking it's going to be over quite quickly. That cavalry on the right is going to cause me a problem. Oh, my light gun! My light gun is caught in a trap. I suppose retrospectively, there's no point shooting at them there. There's just a point of just rush, uh, just charge them to break the cohesion. Oh my disaster! Did they drop two levels? They vacated that. <laughs> okay, let's go and wreak revenge on his cannon crew. The impact, bad. Beam slam is amazing. It's ama this, this mod is amazing. The only downside is the, the, the smoke needs to last a few more seconds. That's the only thing I can... Oh, God, we're going to get... Might as well go gun, hawk, go gun glory. Uh, I shoot him here. I don't think they've got... I, I think it's a bit further on further on in time. I don't think they have plugged bayonets. That was a thing, wasn't it? Where they just uh, didn't want to didn't want to actually fire their muskets anymore. Just, just club them with the back end of it. He's attacking my cannon crew with the light guns that were shooting canister shots. This was very nearly just over for, for him. Uh, so point of guard carbon is so it's engineer uh, general troop quality. Uh, if you 
I'll, as soon as my turn finishes, I shall uh, give you the link. I think the link's in the chat just above. Uh, I don't know if I can click off this. Oh, I can. Just drop the link into the chat for you. There is two. There's the... There's two. There's an updated version of it as well. I think we're playing the updated version. Not a problem. Oh, we're here to, to share the glory. Oh. Oh, 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 la la! Let's char! No, no! Oh, that's how they throw bombs. They throw bombs on the impact. I'm glad I figured that one out. Uh. I like that detail. Who's gonna get who's gonna get shot? Oh, you're gonna get rid you're gonna get lad derry They're gonna get some lad derry At least the cavalry fragmented still can move quite well. Oh, he's kind of just shotting me now. <laughs> This is bad magic. Oh, we're going to get two. Two La Derriers. Oh. <laughs> we have no cavalry. We don't need any cavalry. Thank you. Finally, he got disrupted. This brings me back to the punishment of Pike and Shot. Oh, I've not played that in ages. They so need to make a number two of that. A rally! Oh, the poor grenadiers are about to get whooped. Cheeky Bulgarian. You know the cheeky Bulgarians. That lives in my head rent free, that does. <laughs> Woo! Oh, they just suck it. Don't care. We've got, we've got to go and get that cannon. we got to get the cannon. Oh, they're up there. In. Uh, not pretty many of them left. Oh! What did I say? Oh, and he, sh he reaction fires them as they go out. Uh, that's all the magic I can do. Stop it. Oh, he kind of just shot me in the face. <laughs> they did not like that. <laughs> oh, it tipped. Oh, that actually helped me out a lot. We 
Get any more rallies? Anyone? Rally? Anyone want to rally? Somebody? Yes! I like right now the musketeers. Oh, I can't charge the bloody cannons. Oh, <laughs> oh. Oh, it's... it's harsh. Uh, oh. Okay, we shall take Cinderella to the ball. That's all I can do. Canister in the face. Canister in the face. Oh no, that's it. I think we're done. We're done now. That was so. That I literally thought we we're going to win that. He got them a couple of rallies, and it brought him back in the game. We'll up the point list a little bit. We'll up the points so he isn't so decimating with his cavalry. Where can we actually form like a... Oh, I, I want to kill this cannon. I'm sorry. You, you, you're going down, lad. <laughs> yep. You know what? That was regardless of losing there, folks. I actually really enjoyed that. It was really good. All right, well, we'll up the point list here a little bit. No, but that that was fun. That was fun. Let's see if we can do a large battle. Gotta say the computer player re played really well there as well. Like it was actually nice to come back there. Like I said, we had that twenty-five. There were twenty-five points like mid-game there, and he just brought it back. I'm sure the uh, the people of the interwebs are doing uh, mods as it is. We need another new pike and shot. That's what we need. Just need a pike and shot. Can we actually get... Oh, we can only have two guns still. Ugh. Can we just have, like, a, gr a ton of grenadiers above average? Above average. We're going to try and maybe try and gun line it with just, like, an absolute truckload of infantry. Because this cavalry cannot... It, it, it can't deal with that infantry. Oh, there's like a... So, we've got Dragoons, Cesars. Musketeers are average, and they're... Uh, yeah, that's fine. We'll see if we can just tank it with an absolute truckload of infantry here. I mean, I don't know how the other Slytherin title thing... Yeah, I mean, I don't know if if there's any other mods or mods uh, modders doing more. Uh, what can we afford for forty six points? Oh, okay, so it's fine. We'll have some cavalry in the back, I guess.
That canister shot was evil. Oh, what a line. Instant off the bat. At least it's nice to have cannons that don't deploy. Like the bombard that deploys. I suppose the light artillery doesn't deploy. But the bombard does. How's he deployed his cab? Oh, a whole bunch of naughty cavalrymen to the left. He's just come with two. Well, he's got he's got the same as uh, limitations as his one light, one medium. Yeah, it keeps reaction fire, so I don't think you can move it because of it. Okay, let's bring these... Uh... So you push him to the left. It's just European. I think it only has the Prussians and Austrians, I guess. I don't know if there's any... I need to go and check the mod page to see what else is on there. Oh my god, that unit of just musketeers just got decimated in that first run. Turks would be cool. That would be good. Let's just murder these uh, uh, cavalrymen. I love the reaction fire of uh, a what do you call it? Um, pike and shot. I missed it. keeps reaction firing because he can't then Concentrate on some of that cavalry. Oh, I mean, I'm not too hot on the banners, I would say, uh, being slammed. You'll have to link me what a Prussian banner should look at this time. Oh, my word, he means business. So it interrupts him as he moves closer with the reaction fire. Absolutely spitting distance here. What in can't he went he went for it?
going to do a bit of research after the stream, I think. I've got some time. I'll have a quick look. Oh, have that. Woo! What's the POA? Oh my, giddy gum drops. Uh, what's the P what is actually the POE here? So we're getting troop quality. He has pistol, so the pistol melee is 100. If we drop the general in there, that will give us that. F oh god, not great. Oh god, Mr. York it was a bit like Icarus there, getting a bit too close to the sun. He start concentrating on a few units here. You brought your cannon forward. Granata! That is cool. I'm really impressed with that. I've got to be careful here. These don't just flood through this position. Get wrecked, son. Don't fire cannons of shot at me and get away with it. Oh, I've not played Empire Total War in years. Absolutely years. You should enjoy playing that. We get some good cohesion checks here once we break this cavalry. Oh, it's getting shredded. The 300 Light Brigade, we shall call them. I can't imagine being under that weight of fire. Now to the cannons. The cannons shouldn't cause cohesion checks for the infantry. Let's see if he actually worked that into the mod. Yeah, so they didn't drop. Yeah, so let's do this to the left to the right. Oh, he holds still. Perfect. Let's bring, let's bring this cavalry to the left. Got range for days. Some panic on that guy in the centre. We should, in theory, now not being disrupted, just really carve them up. That disruption dropped that percentages. So he's got uphill troop quality general. He's just for 50 for the general and the troop quality. 
Now we get to shoot you to death. Uh, Your canister still. Come on. Hmm, definitely. If you can club somebody with the pistol when you've shot, if you've got like two pistol braces, you can fire both pistols and start whacking to me over the head with it. Like, I can't imagine reloading a musket in normal conditions, but when somebody's shooting back at you. I suppose it's training, isn't it? It's training. I suppose people have been trained to do that process and it's second nature and then just applying that for when it's under fire Cavalry really picked the wrong day to charge that there. Oh, I like that's a good idea, that is. The reload thing here is nice. Let's just see if we can see it in action. Because I... Yeah, that reload uh, animation is, is pretty cool. That's... Canister the no no break. Uh, let's feed ourselves through here a little bit. And I misclicked there as well, so that's my fault. I gotta be kit oh wrong one first. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> we should have shot them with maybe the reaction. Ooh. At least the cat. I like how the cannonball. Uh, I think it happens in Field of Glory. The the artillery shots stay put on the map.
decimation. We did well this cavalry on the left, but the infantry on the mid-right section seems to have done very well as well. Cannons, quick. Yeah, you can, can't you? I remember that. Uh, let's shoot first. Auto break was good. Oh, oh! It's like a range of emotions. Let's get this mod is. I wasn't expecting them to stand. Uh... <laughs> no, you can use your imagination. You can use your imagination. <laughs> oh crap. Oh, it's a canister, isn't it? Oh. Okay, push the general out of there before he dies horribly. That was really a turkey shoot on that left side against the uh, enemy cavalry. That was not pretty. Musketeers. A lot of German musketeers coming this way. Actually worked out really good, that did. But not surprising, his cavalry sat behind me as well. Guys, are gonna die horribly. Uh, oh. Back to the board. Okay. Oh, 
overcrate. <laughs> Peter player coming back again. Just about to break him. And he just pulls off the amazing ladder air charges. Oh, we just we just go double double whammy drop. Now we've got a form up from that centre looking right. Get a good gun line ready. <laughs> wow. He took the pain train. Let's just form upon this centre if we can as quickly as possible. Uh, you're happy shooting him up. Uh, oh, we're all low ammo. He's probably on. He's probably got a lot of ammo here to the right. If we scoot around here, we can scoot down from behind. Oh, you cheeky, cheeky boys. Oh, I can charge them. I want to get rid of this medium gun, I think. This is going to be harsh for me here. There's a lot of troops, not a lot of fresh troops quite ready. Okay, we can charge here. I don't know if we get reaction fire or not. Nope. Uh, let's see if we can pull away there. All right, canister shot in the face. Well, at least we form some sort of line now to fight the horde of musketeers who is about to send us. Okay, the final showdown. Halfway there. There's a lot of fresh troops, though. We do have some cavalry on, the, the, on his side of the border that can swoop over. Another rally from Broken. I don't know, is he in a control zone or not there to get that cannon still? Oh. We decided to charge. Bad job for him. Uh, 
Uh, yes, secondary control zone, unfortunately. Any cohesion? No. Okay, push that cavalry up there. I think we're going to get outshot here. I've got a strange feeling here he's going to just outshoot us completely. Double whammy dropped. Yeah, I've got a strange feeling here. He's just going to outshoot us. Because most of the musketeers are quite fresh. But we've sat on that back right for a long time. Oh, my word. And if he keeps getting all these rallies. 51. We can do it. We can do it. Not if he keeps getting these rallies where I can't particularly engage the units. Possibly charge the cannon. Possibly get that unit in the rear at the back. Just lock it in with all the great cohesion drop. Well, that's the way, that's the cookie crumble. That's the way it happens. He should go up there to engage him. We should be able to charge the cannon, which we are. Oh, we can plug a few of these guys. Oh my word, there's gonna be a couple of uh, huge cohesion drops. of that. Irritating bit of the movement. Not enough. Them two rallies I think saved him quite well that mid game. Oh, when he rallies another level, do we hit him to the left? No. We're going to get some massive drops here. Very close. the will in the world now. Could auto break here with, an, with our strength of numbers. He broke him for 55. No, it's typically fresh musketeers here. Cavalry can steal it in the last couple of turns. Oh, too little, too late. That was nasty. See if we can pull it back. You closer, possibly on that right side, if we get some more cohesion drops. He 
were still ra uh, chasing that unit. Yeah, that rally, that little rallies he got tipped the game to his balance there. And there's the 63. What happens here? 58. Unless we get a rally. the shot. It's just brutal. Oh, he's going to rally and then get... Oh, he's back. One more turn. We're still in. Just only just in. Uh, oh, okay, what is he... Flee! No, it's over. <laughs> Yeah, I've got to say, everything here is is really nice. Oh, we're we're back home. Oh no, no, the numbers are really bad. We get a little bit of uh, comeback for a slight second, and then look, another rally. Oh, it's insane! I'm getting salty. Oh my word. I'm sorry, the computer player has had the most insane amount of rallies in this game. And then all of them uh, cohesion bubble drops have been a little bit brutal on my part. 74, cheeky cheeky. Let's try. We've got time for one more, I think. Let's see if we can get uh, try and get some pride back. Okay. Oh, 78. <laughs> <gasps> Means business. There we go. That, that was really, really fun, though. That was really fun. That was just decimation, though. Like, proper decimation. Let's go. We'll play Saxons. Uh, we'll go large again. We can do large again. But, oh, God. You got a couple of nice rallies. But that could happy to happen to any players. So I can't really be too salty about it. You got some nice rallies. A, a couple of mine did drop two levels of cohesion uh, and that was rather nasty okay we are getting gifted like the best hill in mankind oh god this is uh, like Oh wow, wow! Uh, we'll go all left with the, all right with the cavalry, and the infantry will uh, sit down and shoot from the hills. Ugh, God, that the 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 big the unfortunately the uh, the big cannon's not going to particularly have a place anywhere, is it? Like apart from maybe at the back, maybe. We are going to need some infantry supporting the cavalry. Maybe stick it on the right. And it can't go on the wall. Oh, God. This is like... We, we may have to take... Oh, we can't even take the medium gun off. So we're stuck with it in a bad position. Uh, That's all the infantry we can take. So the rest would have to be dragoons. And there we go.
Oh, Grace Commander. Straight off the bat. I don't know what I can and can see here. We'll have to trape to this right side. At least we'll have the hill. Can he actually see anybody? Oh no, he's just going to be. It'll be a no com It'll no cans for us. No cans to shot this game. Most of his cavalry on the left, so this will be quite interesting to see what happens. Don't be shooting my cav. Come on, me bro. Is it a difficult. Oh, he's moderately disordered there on that. Wanna keep some reserve. I think we wanna keep some reserve. Isn't canister shot the same as grape shot? Or is it a distinct difference? Or is canister just normal rounds? Is it just no word for normal rounds? Ugh, drag that cannon. Oh, they just just count as the same. I'm facing the wrong way. This would be cool in like the War of Independence. I'd like that to see that. Oh God, he gum drops. Here they come. Firing rusty spoons at your enemy. It's like the junk. Is it? What's, what's it? The Fallout weapon? Junk? Fire? What's it called? Junk something? Oh god, he disrupted my cab. Junk launcher. That's the one. Oh god, that poor cannon. Oh, it's, it's, just, it's just worthless. This is probably bad because he has more units facing that unit. He can actually face off more units on that corner.
get his infantry shooting this cavalry up as much as possible. Swoop where I maybe get this cannon if we get lucky. Oh, I can find the cannon! Still can't shoot him. And who did they take with him? Oh, that's the worst that could have happened there. That's a lot of cavalry. Are you in the UK? Is that is that a reference to what you the UK with them two horses? Yeah, yeah, d ditto, ditto. Oh, why can't he drop cohesion? Why do only I drop cohesion? Why does he just go? Well, I'm just going to bounce it. Like every time the computer player just like, I'm just not gonna drop, I'm just gonna. Everything's fine. What? He's. He's stuck! He's caught in a trap! Reaction fire. Oh. Oh, it's cheeky charge. Cavalry is malingering in the rear, which is a valid military tactic, as we all know. Jeez. 
This explains why being rank and file is not a good thing. Thankfully, the, the first rally since the Jesus was alive. What the heck? Oh, I messed that one up, didn't I? The Harbinger, the Harbinger of Evil is here. Okay, we're going to have to go in the woods tonight. Welcome to the pain train of muskets. Ooh. Okay, keep pushing them back, keep pushing forward. Let's do this here. Next turn, we'll do that. Oh, no! No! It looks like the opposite side of the board, though. We've been bazinga, guys. Oh, when he breaks me. Oh, the worst possible thing happens as well. This is just not going well. I can see blue on the bottom left, like under my shoulder. It's not behind me. You all can take a sigh of relief. Get out of town. I've, I've had karma all night. She's not been nice. Oh no, I misclicked. I misclicked. That was horrid. That was horrid. That misclick was just pain. I got like five reaction fires in a row. Oh no, I read the numbers and I didn't think it was great. Uh, okay, sure.
Can we turn this around? Them grenadiers certainly did just walk my ass. It's so much fun. It's so much fun. Just not the receiving end of like six units of uh, reaction fire in one foul swoop. It's just not nice. Always on the swamp. He's in the swamp. <laughs> it's just insane. Not one drop in cohesion for them troops stand, stood around that you know that broke. They just took it and went, well, we don't care. Uh, you can come out of there. Yeah, that's true, Sir Coyd. I, I do agree with that. It's not, it's, it's f for the, for the mod itself, it's still really cool though. Yeah. It's still nice, though, I've got to say. I, I, I've only got good things to say about this mod. Apart from the computer player getting it, the most insane amount of rallies. Get wrecked, Sonny Jim. Get wrecked. Oh, these are my broken troops. <laughs> it's a thing of beauty, these cohesion checks. My medium good not being able to move. <laughs> oh, what? What? I'm just getting schooled. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, have you noticed that the really bad cohesion checks? That, that general fled. Everybody didn't like it. Nobody liked it. <laughs> we can come back though. <sighs> Got plenty of troops to fill the ranks though, we're fine. The smoke, like I said, needs to linger a few more seconds. Okay, there we go. I want to protect this cannon from getting smashed. The 
poor medium gun that can't move. I'm in awe about the amount of rallies this computer player has got tonight. So we're about to auto break for some losses here. Come on, keep going, keep going. Finally, their ranks are breaking. A nice fragmentation here would be nice. I think he's going to auto break. Let's get that hill. Push these to the far, far left. The poor medium gun. He's on his own. Oh, I can turn him, but I think it's a bit too late, unfortunately. He's so close to breaking. That rea reaction fire is insane. Uh, let's see if we get. Come on. Push him back into the swamps, lads. We've got some cavalry can push over that far left, but he's got plenty to match the, the flank. Yeah, he's, he's gone. Everybody hold it firm. So chaotic. I'll do this first, see where he ends up. Then I can react to that. That's actually perfect. Apart from that one unit breaking through. Not one bloody drop of cohesion for anybody around them there. That was slightly annoying. Grenadiers drop though. They double drop on there as well. <laughs> wow. That was rough. You take take it. We'll take it. 
it's back and forth, and I'd prefer a back and forth game than a complete game that just trounces the enemy or I get trounced. I feel like I've not, I have received a lot more drops and heaters on the, uh, on the cohesion front. It's been ridiculous. Oh, massively. Oh, here we go. Come on, I'm sure we can try and pinch the victory out of this. Close. be happy for a rally here for me just one unit rallying up somewhere to give us that extra few points the problem is this guy's going to explode okay uh, we don't want to engage them let's say that has to turn here. This guy's going to get charged in the rear, I think, and that's going to be maybe end. Let's see. It's going to be close. Got to concentrate some musket fire. As long as he don't get insane rallies. Come on. Pray to the guard. Rock and roll. Oh. Low ammo is harsh. Oh, the grenadiers! The grenadiers are here! Oh no!
Uh, though that, I trust you, Sir Coin. Please don't put links like that, because uh, even though you're a first-time chat and I'm sure it is legit, uh, uh, please be careful putting links. Even though you, I know you probably you, you seem okay, but just uh, bear in mind it's first time chatting here. Away. Oh, let's not do anything worse. Quick, end the turn. End the turn. End the turn. <laughs> the cannon nearly broke it. <laughs> the cannon nearly lost us that. End it. Quick. Quick. Oh, F4. Quick. Quick. <laughs> He's so close. It's ridiculous. Oh, oh, oh. One cohesion check. One cohesion check. No, no, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> It's a draw, isn't it? No, it's not. It's a win. We got the rally. <laughs> there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, what an absolutely fantastic we've had tonight on this What Is Your Mod? I want to say, of course, thank you to Slivering Games for always letting me come back on their channel to stream my favourite, uh, one of my favourite games from the Slivering lot. Uh, it has been um, amazing just over an hour and 45 minutes huzzah huzzah remember to go check the mod out i will put a link on to the uh, uh the chat but if you're watching this previously or after uh, just go on to the field of glory 2 mod on the forum uh, and there we go like i said ladies and gentlemen if you want to come find me on youtube i will post a link but also if you want to come and find me on twitch I will, of course, put my Twitch channel where I do Twitching as well of my favourite Slivering games. I will put uh, some links in the chat. Uh, and there we go, folks. Thank you very much. I'll be back on Friday night for some more Headquarters, hopefully a multiplayer game, if I can uh, coax somebody into a multiplayer game. Uh, it has been amazing. Oh, that was harsh. That was proper harsh, folks. Take care. Have a great day, folks. Let's see if I can do the outro correctly. I don't know if it's going to work. All right, folks, thank you very much. Take care.